hey guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new here welcome to my channel my name is Fidelis don't forget to hit that like button and that subscribe button keep my videos in rotation people so as you can see I'm going to be using the rice water collection by Miel to wash my daughter's hair today I am a product junkie and I um, heard some really good things about this collection so I said hey let me give it a try um, my daughter's hair um, I'm not sure what type it is but it's feel silky it's very curly and long um, it's very thick as well so whatever you type that as type three four I wouldn't say it's um four um whatever C but it it's it's thick so before I use the Miao shampoo I'm gonna go in with my ISO plus um shampoo this is usually a shampoo you would use after a relaxer um to stop the um product from work um working in the hair but it's also a good pre-poo because it removes any dirt oils buildup that you have on the hair um i just recently took her braid she had braids in for about three weeks so yeah this really gets the scalp nice and clean and ready for the shampoo it's also conditioning so it doesn't dry out the hair um it's also a ph balanced shampoo so it turn returns the hair ph back to normal and it's very very good like to keep your hair from being damaged it stops breakage all that stuff so i'd like to do that first um before i actually go in with my um treatment shampoo which today would be our meow rice water conditioning shampoo it smells really good a little bit goes a long way as you can see that one little pump like basically covered her whole head so yeah a little bit goes a long way with their products the shampoo is very thick and it works very well it got her hair very clean it smells super good the, and it lathers up really nice as you can mm. see I go through um, her hair to make sure that I'm getting every single part of her scalp she likes to keep trying to look at the keep trying to look at the camera because she knows it's on I have to move her head back and forth <laughs> but I'm not hurting her she's good mm. All right, back to massage that scalp really good because there's nothing like washing the hair and then having to go back to the sink because you missed a swat. So I part the hair into sections and I scrub, 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 scrub. <laughs> Now, after I thoroughly washed that out, I am gonna make sure that I got all of the shampoo out of her hair, starting from the root all the way down to the end of her hair. Those curls like to hold on to the soap, make sure you get all that out as well. Um, it may look like I'm being rough, but I'm not. The video is sped up, so yeah. Now we're gonna go in with our rice water deep conditioner treatment. This is also very thick and it works 
very well it smells very good um so i start off by at the ends and then work my way inside i part her hair into sections and make sure that i get each and every section with the product so that it can all work its way through I'm using my detangler brush. You can get this brush off of Amazon. And it is a very good brush to use when you are doing this because it is ouch free and it does not rip or pull at your curls at all. It is very gentle. Now, after we finish shampooing and conditioning, I rinse her out and we're back in our chair. I'm going to be using the rice water moisturizing milk on her hair. Prior to me um, blow drying it, I'm using it as a moisturizer leave-in and um, a detangler because it really works that well. For all of those things and also after shampooing and conditioner here it wasn't really hard to de it wasn't hard to detangle at all as you can see i'm using my wide tooth um comb is easy to part is easy to comb through um i could say i give this product a 10 out of 10 and it slashed my um washing blow drying time in half it will usually take me about two and a half hours to just do this process alone on her because her hair is so long and thick but i say i mean you um between the wash and the blow dry i would say about an hour and some change but i also had to clip her ends because i haven't done that in a while so yeah, it, the whole process took about three hours, but the washing and conditioning was really done quickly. Here I'm going in with the Rosemary Mint Scalp Drops and they work beautifully. I've been using this product for about, uh, say about five, five months now. And as you can see, her hair is very nice mm -hmm. and thick um her curls are very nicely maintained she loves these drops they tingle on her scalp as you can see this is her favorite part and then i go in and do the blow drying process
Hi Naya. <laughs> now after her hair is fully blow dried, this is what it looks like. I wasn't trying to get the straightest press because I am going to be um, flat ironing and clipping her ends. I just wanted it to be nice and dry. But that blow dryer really works the bomb. And um, I went in with the rice water shine mist. Um, it did leave her hair a little damp. So um, to work that into her hair, I'm going to use the blow dry again. This time on a cool setting to close the cuticle of the hair and to lock in that product. It is very important to go over the hair with a cool blow a cool blow dryer to lock in the product and to hold the shine and close the cuticle after the heat process. So yeah. This is her hair after it's fully blow dried. Beautiful. Now I'm gonna go in with my flat iron and I also clipped her ends. As you can see, she has a beautiful shine. Her hair looks nice and healthy. And shout out to me out, cause y'all really outdid yourselves with these, with these products. Thanks for watching.